India has witnessed a remarkable transformation over the past decade. In a recent report by Morgan Stanley, the progress made by India in various economic aspects since 2013 has been highlighted. As per the report, this India is different from what it was in 2013. In just 10 short years, India has risen through the ranks on the global stage, bringing forth positive consequences for its economy and markets. Let us explore these changes and their implications together. The report states that we often encounter skepticism about India, especially from overseas investors who claim that India has not fulfilled its potential. However, these views fail to acknowledge the significant changes that have taken place in India, particularly since 2014. Morgan Stanley identifies 10 transformational changes that have reshaped India's economic landscape. These changes, driven by India's policy choices, have had far-reaching consequences, positively influencing its macroeconomic situation, global standing and local share markets. Supply-side policy reforms Measures such as bringing corporate tax rates at par with global peers and accelerating infrastructure investments have transformed the supply-side dynamics. Infrastructure development has accelerated with an impressive increase in national highways and broadband consumer base. For instance, the construction of 53,700 kilometers of national highways between 2014-15 and 2022-23 far exceeds the 25,700 kilometers built between 2005-06 and 2013-14. This expansion of the road network is crucial for improving connectivity, fostering trade and driving economic growth. Formalization of the economy. The introduction of the GST and the rising share of digital transactions signify the formalization of India's economy. The consistent increase in tax collections under the GST indicate a significant formalization of the economy. Additionally, digital transactions as a percentage of GDP have skyrocketed from 4.4% in 2015-16 to an impressive 76.1% in 2022-23. Real Estate Social Reforms The Real Estate Regulation and Development Act has revitalized the real estate sector, resulting in increased new launches and sales. The report showcases a substantial rise in new property launches and sales, with approximately 75,000 units and 60,000 units respectively recorded in the first quarter of 2022-23. This represents significant growth compared to around 50,000 new launches and 41,000 new sales sales in the second quarter of 2014-15. Social transfers. Direct benefit transfers have streamlined welfare schemes and have witnessed significant growth, with a manifold increase over the last few years. Insolvency and Bankruptcy Code. The implementation of the Insolvency and Bankruptcy Code enhanced the resolution of distressed assets. Flexible Inflation Targeting India's adoption of a flexible inflation targeting framework has contributed to a more stable and benign inflation environment. Focus on FDI A heightened emphasis on attracting FDI has boosted India's global standing as an investment destination. India's 401k moment Government support for corporate profits Policies aimed at supporting corporate profitability have propelled India's private sector and contributed to a doubling of profit shares in GDP. MNC sentiment at multi-year high Improved sentiment among MNCs signifies their growing confidence in India's business environment. The implications of these changes are vast and promising. One significant impact is the rise of manufacturing and capex as a proportion of India's GDP. Morgan Stanley projects a 5 percentage point gain for both. India's export market share is set to double by 2031, reaching 4.5% from the 2021 levels. Per capita income is expected to reach $5,200 within the next decade, leading to a major shift in the consumption basket towards discretionary spending. These structural transformations will strengthen India's external balance sheet, leading to a narrower current account deficit or CAD. Domestic profits are predicted to double, explaining the rich equity valuations. This rise in profits will trigger increased investments, a moderation in the CAD and a boost in credit to GDP, supporting further growth. The implications are not limited to the economy alone. Once these changes are achieved, India's correlation with oil prices and the US recession will decrease.
This could potentially trigger a re-rating in the valuation of domestic share markets, reflecting sustained domestic demand for stocks and higher growth prospects. India's beta to emerging markets has already fallen to 0.6, thanks to improved macro stability and reduced dependency on global capital market flows. This resilience positions India favorably in the global economic landscape. The journey of India's transformation continues, fueled by these remarkable changes. Morgan Stanley's report paints a bright and hopeful picture of India's future, with a projected average growth of 6.5% over the next decade. By 2031, India is poised to become the world's third largest economy with an estimated GDP of nearly $8 trillion. India's journey of transformation is a testament to its resilience and determination to realize its potential on the global stage. Through policy reforms, enhanced market dynamics and strategic initiatives, India is set to shape a brighter future, marked by sustained economic growth and increased global influence.